Hello, John here, also known as Venonator, and welcome back to the TGC Tours. So we're at the EA Sports Memorial at Silverton Forks, and yeah, we're in the final round here. So last round, we actually played, I'm really happy with, we played really well. We got nine under, so yeah, a good result. And yeah, positive week all round, we made the cut again, and we're currently, I believe, in the 20s here, so like 22nd, 23rd, or something to that effect. We'll find out soon enough what happens in this round, and then we'll see get as close as we can to that top 10. I mean, there's nothing to play for in terms of promotion marks or anything like that, so it's quite a chilled out week. But yeah, let's try and play well here and have another good round. So let's see. So we've got black tees, of course, in set four. We've got medium winds from the northwest. We've got firm fairways, firm greens, and the green speed is moderate. Let's play a good round then and see how we get on. Fingers crossed this will be another good one. Which, of course, I hope for every time I play, as you could pretty much imagine. Hello there. But yeah, I was really I'm pleased with how John I played that last Harvey, round. And I'm pleased to welcome you to I mean, we had some disastrous shots. I think this is going to be an extra good round. But um, that back this nine was really good. First hole, okay, so 98% to start with, but yeah, vibes. pretty good. The wind was pulling it forward anyway, so it's gone pretty far. Okay, this is about 155 yards to the pin. This looks like... Probably okay with the elevation and the wind. 98 again. Interesting. Okay, so it's a bit short, okay, but that's okay. The green. I, mean, I think it would have been, been short regardless, but yeah, 98% has made that shorter, obviously. And here we go, potential birdie. Okay, that's a nice straight put line. Went further than I expected, actually. Swift putt coming up. This putt's going. There we go. Okay, so it's a par, I believe. A fine start here. Even par after the first hole. Yeah, happy with par to start off with. Found that hole quite difficult too, birdie. It can obviously be done, but um, yeah. Okay, I'm happy with a par to start. And here we go. Par five. And you have a par five here, so this is an opportunity. Uh. Oh dear. Right into the bunker, is it? Bounce. Oh, nice. There you go. It heard me. Okay, let's okay that worked out. <laughs> distance twice. Okay, so this is 50 feet. So you're looking at. Oof. Okay, you're looking at. My maths has just abandoned me, so I think it's about 17 or so. 200 and... Yes, I've just gone completely blank. Uh, okay. I think this should do. It's been a long day. I'm doing this right after round number three as well, and my brain's just... Fried. I've started basically. I've become a student again. Essentially, I'm in my thirties, so it's I'm not a young man. I'm not an old man either, I suppose. I guess it depends on how you look at it. But um, send this ball home. You'll my brain is not working card. anymore. After studying. Oh yeah, brilliant. Okay. Well, that one dropped, and that's for birdie. There we go. Well, we've got a birdie out of it. Yeah, so that's pretty good. So yeah, pretty decent start. One under through two, which I believe is what I was on at the start of the last round as well. Okay, I'm going to go with this and hope the wind does enough here. It's quite a dangerous hole if the wind doesn't do enough. It's looking... Yeah, it's just about enough, I think. Brilliant. Okay. You're going to like that, won't you? All right, if you can sink this, snatch a birdie and be on our way. Turn... Just about. There we go. Worried it wasn't going to turn, but it did. So there you go. Good start. Two under through three. Starting to sound good. If only it stayed like that, that'd be amazing. You never know. Good. But 24 under. Starting to look like a pretty respectable, uh, respectable, a respectable week. That's a decent shot. Should be in the um, in the fairway. Here's your second 383 yards, not going to complain at that one. Um, 
see how much the wind does here. I've applied some spin to this. Ah, no, it's gone too far. Way too far. Oh, look at that. We're on the green. With rolling all over the place well there. And this oh, yeah, and you can see why. Watch. Let's see how you do with this long, long putt. It's a very awkward shaped part of the green. Oh, no, it's going really fast as well. Okay. And good luck here. Is Let's this salvageable? It should be. So far, so good. Good putt. There you go. Right, okay, so we've got a par. I'm happy to get a par out of that because it looked a bit dangerous for a while. So yeah, pleased with that. I'm pleased with how I played this week in general, really. And yeah, next week it's the final week of the TGC Tours. I'll be making a video on all my progress and showing exactly what what I've done this season. But wow, yeah, it's, I don't believe it's over already. It feels like it's just begun really um, okay sorry I'm just doing some calculations in my head again or trying to and okay so I'm gonna do sandwich but I'm gonna lower lower the distance and then make it slow so it lowers it even uh, more unfortunately heading a bit to the right okay, okay. Oh, sorry that's Here's a bit a of a jolt shot. I hope that wasn't too disorientating for people watching Okay. Nice tempo on that chip. Just nice and easy. Well done. Okay, decent. Okay, it's a par from that. But after that shot, um, that shot that went nowhere near the green, I'm pretty pleased. Blowing left to right on yeah, this Yeah, 24 one. under. I'm happy with 24 under as well at the moment. I'm going to try and get this over here, because why not? It's the end of the season. There's no promo marks to play for. And that's why you don't do that, because the wind no was good. way too strong because of the Here's loft there. Second shot on the sixth. Okay. This might find oh, some trouble. This is looking pretty good. This is looking nice. There you go. I'm actually glad I was wrong there. Ended up on the green. I like it. Looking pretty good. Nice. Okay, that worked oh, out that pretty well. I mean, I was hoping it would from that pitch shot, but I wasn't... I don't know. It's a bit of a gamble doing that shot, to be honest. So this is the thing. I'm just I'm trying out a few things here on the last few events, just at the end here, anyway. Now on a par three. Okay, so this is 49. So we're looking at about 16, basically, I believe. 16 down. So we're looking at 194. And then the wind. I add quite a loft to that. The wind should pull it even more. Let's see what this does. Well, maybe this will kick left. It's pulled even more than I expected, but that's yeah, okay. That's gonna do just nicely. And this putt for the birdie. Fingers crossed. This gets close. It's looking very good, actually. Oh, yeah, that brilliant. Was almost in. Happy with a par there. Right, let's move on to the next. I used to just be happy with pars all the time, but the standard's gone up with how difficult the the CCG division Stepping is. On to a par five hole on this one. But yeah, overall, I am happy when I get pars most of the time. Okay, okay I'll another good tee shot. Yeah, from here we're looking at about. We're looking at nine up from so here, so hundred and uh, sorry, two hundred and six. And if I go here, with the wind, and I've accidentally shot it left to the right, but it doesn't matter. It still went left. Brilliant because of the wind, of course. Oh, so, not bad. Not a bad effort. Work on the approach. You saw that one, didn't you? Setting up here, looking for the eagle. Oh, wow, that's turned more than I expected. Uh, Setting up here with a four-foot putt. Okay, nice well, we've got a birdie. It's a shame. That was a good eagle opportunity right there, but happy with that approach shot. That was good. And overall, pretty decent start here to this fourth yeah, round. There. We got a tailwind blowing. Okay, so this is going up quite a bit, but the wind's going to pull this, actually. 
This is a tough one. A pitch shot off, off the tee is unusual. Well, it's unlucky. Missed the green okay. on that approach. Here's our second shot on the ninth. Roll close enough. Uh, this much left to save par on this one. Not the best hole. This one's tracking. Just about. Well Just about got a par out of it, and we're yeah, I'm happy with a with a par. Ooh, pretty good front nine, four under. Four under to start. That's that's a decent start with the front nine, especially last time on the last round. I didn't even get that. I believe I don't think I got close. I got one under through the front nine or something to that effect. Wind not particularly strong on this particular uh, on this uh, on this hole. Four miles an hour. Five now, but still. Elevated green. So we're looking at 11, so 11 up, so 225. Free iron. With a bit of loft, maybe. Probably going to go too far, actually. This one's heading left. Not bad. And this is our third shot. Well, that was a bit of a Looks like we could have a questionable on this chip. Looking good. It's very cautious chip. Not good sure why I was so cautious. But we got a birdie out of it anyway. So pleased enough with that. 27 under. So we're looking in a really good place in terms of our scoring now. Because 30 under until very recently was the best I've ever hit on the TGC tours. And this is a short par 4 we're taking a hack out of right now. Okay, so I'm going to try and hit this up here. And I'm going to completely miss hit it on purpose, of course. It's not the end of the world, it's okay. It's our second shot on hole number 11. Okay, so flop shot this. Oh, wow, that went really left. I guess the, the lie I was in was very left. Should have looked at that before I hit from it. From a cool 38 feet away. It's not the worst looking putt, considering. These uphill ones, sometimes I actually quite like them. No, well, that's going but, right by the hole, isn't it? And so they tend to slow down up. quite nicely, so they don't roll away. The downhill ones, you have the opposite problem. Okay, well that's that's a decent start to so the back nine. We got a par. it too fast ah all right in time the to get out of the bunker let's do this sorry i'm just um doing all sorts here by the looks of it bounce forever no not the best and this is your third shot it's a bit of a dangerous thing to chip this, actually, too far. Can I roll down the hill? No, we're okay. And this one to save par. Looking good. There we go. Okay, we got a par. Okay, good job on this one. Yeah, I mean, I would have been a bit more aggressive with that chip, but I was a bit concerned about it rolling away from me. And down, down a hill or something. But yeah, the back nine has been okay so far. The back nine started incredibly well on that Wind's third round. Up. We got a tailwind to deal with. Done with the safer shot. Miss hit it, but I've gone for the safer shot, and that's put it in a nice position there. Yeah. And here's our second shot on the thirteenth. Okay. So I just went with it as it is, but added spin Ooh, to it to try and stop good. it. Okay, it's worked out pretty Here's nice. A seven foot putt. Yeah, decent. In there for birdie. Yeah, that that worked out pretty nicely in the end. So a nice birdie. Yeah, that pitch shot went pretty much as planned. Went a little bit further than obviously I'd hope it to, but overall, yeah, went well. Getting a look at the fourteenth hole now. Okay, so this is eleven feet. Down, but then the wind is really pulling this. How much is this going to make a difference? 
went with a bit of a different approach. I lowered the just heading uh, left. The loft on that one, but it, it didn't work very well because I completely mishit it. So, but whether or not that would have helped, I have no idea. That's the problem with mishitting it. Okay. Here we go. Power putt coming up. So it's it's a power putt. It's getting there. It needs to go in, and it has. And in the cup. There you go. In that third round, I did miss a really straight putt. So there was a bit of me wondering whether that, that was going to happen again there, but fortunately not. So there we go. Four holes left, 28 under. It up on a par four. Pretty pleased with how this week has gone. Yeah, something was a miss on that swing, I think. Okay, well, I got fortunate that yeah, that was in, about, the, I'd say two, in the fairway. 245 to the pin. What is going on with my tempo now? Not quite sure where this will end up. I think I've fallen asleep. This one's your third. Right, is it safer to do a flop shot here? Right, so I can do a flop shot pretty comfortably, actually. That was the right shot. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, that was definitely the right shot there, I'd say. Not going to complain of that one. Okay, so 29 under now. Perfect. So we're on 8 under, I believe, for this round. Careful out there. Wind's going left to right on this hole. We've got 12 feet down, so 152. Nice easy maths for once. Add some loft to this. Hit it over here because of the wind. Maybe add some spin. It's a bit short, but That'll it's bounced in the right area, so we're us. okay. Good luck here. Nine feet away. It could be a good one. Please go in. Just yeah, thank you. There. That's your eighth there we go. Well eighth birdie of the day, not complaining about that, and they're only birdies as well. There you go. Did I say it was eight under before? Well, it's eight under now, by the looks of it. Was I on 22 under before? Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, I must have been. I'm completely losing track of what's going on here. But yeah, 8 under, it's a, it's a good final round here as well. Yeah, that'll work. And here's our second shot on the 17th. Oh, so that's the highest flop shot, so it's a bit risky to do that. Sorry, I'm just going all over the place here, trying to figure out what's best to do here. So if I lower the pitch shot as much as I can... Oh, I was hoping it would bounce Third more than shot. that, but that's not bad. Not, not going to complain at that one. And this is a safe shot more than anything Great else. Tip that one close, well done. Okay, good enough. Quite pleased that um, pitch shot went okay. So yeah, maybe didn't need to put quite as much loft on it. Teeing her up here on a long par five. Yeah, decent tee shot. Yeah, happy with that. Time for our second shot here on number 18. Right, so I'm going to aim over to the side here and hope this bounces into a nice position. Ah, oh, and I hit it slow. Just not what I wanted to do. Setting up here now for our third shot. Okay. Come on, get a nice bounce, but stop would be nice as well. Oh, it's gone way too far. And you have this That's okay. for a final score of 62 on the day. Try and get the pacing right, really. Ooh. Decent. And drop this one in for your par. Okay, okay. so got a par, but that's 30 drops. under in an 8 under round. So, very pleased with that. Yeah, so there we go. So that's two 8 under rounds, a 9 under round, and I think it was a 6 under, 5 under round the first well, time round. But yeah, pleased. It's been a good week.
positive way to end this week. So we'll go into the final week on a high, in a positive mood. So yeah, I'll see you very soon for the final PGC Tour event of the season. Until then, goodbye.